Hi there, and welcome back to Daily Bible Promises with a Twist. And today, as always, we're going to begin by reading one verse from one Bible promise card. He heals the brokenhearted and binds up their wounds. And I'm going to put this verse into context by reading from the Passion Translation, verse 2 and 3. The Lord builds up Jerusalem. He gathers up the outcasts and brings them home. He heals the wounds of every shattered heart. There's many Christians who consider themselves a disciple of Christ and they have surrendered their life into Christ's hands and yet they are exiles. Perhaps they are the victim of a church split. Perhaps they've been shunned from a church. Perhaps they were deeply wounded by a church and now they have found themselves in exile and they feel somewhat of an outcast. But for whatever reason, they feel isolated, they feel like an outcast, and their heart is wounded. I know that there'll be many people who are watching this little clip who have been severely wounded in church settings. And I sincerely apologize as a member of the body of Christ for those wounds that we have inflicted upon you. However, I encourage you to step back towards fellowship, find a new home, find a new place where you belong, a place where you will allow yourself to be known once again. The wounds that have been inflicted upon us by those who call themselves Christian most times are only healed when we step back into Christian community and allow a body of believers to love us back into health. If you're feeling like you're an outcast, if you feel that you are so wounded, there's no way that you could ever darken a church again or reach out to other Christians, know that I am praying for you and I'm praying that you find a safe place. And in the meantime, I'm praying that you will feel the Lord's comforting arms around you and that you will no longer feel an outcast and that you will feel his healing touch, restoring that shattered heart. Be gentle with yourself. Yes, because God is very gentle with you, but don't take that act of being gentle with your heart as an excuse not to step forward and to take a risk once again.